So let me show the chart. Let me share the chart. Side in side by side view, basically. This side, let's keep the question paper and let's side this side, let's keep the keep our chart. Okay, this is the chart I'm going to use the same chart and this one this side. This paper is 2019, that is not relevant. Okay, now we can, so you can see the chart. Two means, two in chart. Two means here, zero, zero, one, zero. Two means zero, zero, one, zero. Here, zero, zero, one, zero. Then B means B. B means one, zero, one, one. B means one, zero, one, one. Zero, zero, one, zero. 1011 that is number one question number one the answer question number three answer is number one so that's easy so now what's easy dividing no using this table i think now using the table is the easiest method right now because dividing is kind of expensive again it will take some time no but now you can see table is easiest way to find the answer right then okay then refer to the question number four then refer to the question number four and try to do question number four try to do question number four Okay, for the fourth one, what you have to do is convert this to one single number system. All four convert to one. So easiest is binary, no? Easiest is binary. Let me convert this to binary number systems. That is the easiest way. The first one, first one, so let's, I'm writing this. First one binary is given 1001, 1001. The second one binary is 0, 1 means 110 according to the table here. 1 means octal, 113, 1 means 001, again 001, again 011. So you can add 0 here to balance it. Okay, now this is the second one. Third one. 160 in, I'm not going to convert that now. Fourth one, 1A. One, 1 means 0, 0, 0, 001. A means 1010. That is the fourth one. And third one, 160. 160 you have to divide. 160 you have to divide. Divide and write the remainder. And you'll get something like uh, 160, 128, take uh, 32. I think this is 160. 128 plus 128 plus 32 is 160. Okay, then which is the largest? Largest is 160. This is 160. That is largest. What is the smallest? Smallest is this one. 1A is the smallest. So 1A to 160. 1A to 160 is the fourth one and fourth one is the answer so most of you have given second one why they are asking ascending order ascending order means increase in order ascending order means increase in order which is large and which is so you have to convert this to one number system otherwise you can't tell exactly just looking at this you can't tell you have to convert this either you have to convert all the numbers to decimal Okay, this is binary. Let me, uh, so this one is, so let's convert this number is, um, 
It's anyway binary, you know. The second one is it is one one three octa. So all these numbers either you have to convert to single number system. The easiest one is binary, or you have to convert to decimal, or you have to convert to decimal. How to convert to decimal? Okay. How do you convert any number to decimal? Any number to binary? Now you know. Divide by two for decimal, but uh, this uh, hexadecimal and octal, you know that. So, what is the mechanism to convert any number to decimal? No, not dividing by decimal. Okay, let me show that. Okay, write down the heading. So, since uh, you don't know that, write down the heading in your book. Write down this heading. Convert from any number system to decimal. 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 Okay, I'll take the first one as example. I'll take this one as the example. This is my number. Example, write example, then write this number in binary. One zero zero, one triple zero, one zero. Okay. Let me remind small thing. Let me remind small thing that you have learned. Maybe that you have learned in your primary grades. Can you remember a kind of? Can you remember some kind of thing? Oh, this one actually. Okay, let's go to our conversion. Can you remember this one? What is this? What is this uh, equipment? Abacus. That is abacus. Right, that is abacus. In your abacus, assume that forget about this decimal part. Think about this yellow, orange, red, and pink color. Yellow, orange, red, pink. Yellow, you have three. Three refers to this one. Ten to the power zeros. Oh. Once, how many ones? Three ones. This two means this two. How many tens? Two into tens because the value of here, value of this digit is ten. This is first digit. Yellow digit is one. Okay, yellow digit is one. This is yellow. The second one is orange. This is orange digit. Let me orange is not there. Any, I'm, I'm not going to mark. The third digit is red digit. Red digit you have eight. That is eight into hundred means eight hundred. Then the pink color one. From pink color one, you have seven. Seven into thousand. Seven thousand. So value of this is seven thousand eight hundred twenty three. Seven thousand eight hundred twenty three. That is the value. That's how you calculate seven thousands eight hundreds ten twos means twenty three three ones. Similar to that, in this binaries you have ones twos fours eights. Similar to that, in octal you have ones eights sixty fours and five twelves. In hexadecimal ones sixteens two five sixes and four thousand ninety six. So how this value comes? Basically, two to the power one. It is one. Two to the power zero, two. Sorry, two to the power zero, one. Two to the power one, two. Two to the power two means two into two, four. Two to the power three means two into two into two, which is eight. Here, eight to the power zero, one. Eight to the power one, eight. Eight to the power eight. That means eight into eight, sixty-four. Here, eight into eight into eight, five twelve. Similar to that, sixteen to the power zero, one. Sixteen to the power one, sixteen. Sixteen into sixteen, 
two five six here sixteen into sixteen into sixteen. You have to use this skill to convert this number to decimal. Okay, how we are converting? So this is what is the value of this digit? What is the value of this digit? So let me write this in a table. If you are not clear, let me write this in a table. I'm going to use a table of okay. Let's see. Then let's reduce the size. Let's reduce the size. Uh, I'm going to write this one, zero, 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 one, zero, 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 one, zero. What is the value of this? This is two to the power zero. Two to the power zero. Value of this is two to the power one. Two to the power two. Two to the power three. Two to the power four. Two to the power five. Zero, one, two, three. Four and five. Then give me the positional value. What is two to the power zero? It is two to the power zero is two to the power zero is yes. Zero. Zero. Any number to power zero is one. One. It's one. Two to the power zero is one. Any number to power zero is one. Any number to power one. Two to the power one. Two. It is same number. Two. Two to the power two means two into two. It is four. Two to the power three means two into two into two. Eight. 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 Two to the power four means two into two into two into two. Sixteen. Sixteen. And two to the power five means thirty-two. Thirty-two. Right. So it always double. Here you can see it always double. One. Two times one is two. Two times two is four. Four into two eight. Atravarat deka atta. Atavarat deka dasya. Eight into two is sixteen. Sixteen into two is thirty-two. It's always double. And mele ma double levi ani. So you have to take. Forget about these zeros because zeros here you have zeros no. When you have zeros, no value. I'm going to mark this in some light gray color. So when you have zeros, no values. Here also you have zeros, no value because when you multiply by zero, no value. Here you have to multiply thirty-two by one, sixteen by zero, no value. Sixteen by I'm going to write this sixteen by zero, no value. Eight by zero, no value. Four by zero, no value. Then two by one, you have value two by sorry. two by one. Here. One by zero, no value. No value portions. I'm going to again highlight this. No value things in this color. This will not affect the final answer. Okay. Now give me the final answer. Here thirty-two. Here you have two. So what is the value of this one? Thirty-two plus two is yes. Thirty-four. Thirty-two plus two is equal to. Thirty-four. This is how you calculate. This is how you calculate to uh, decimal. This is how you calculate to decimal. You have to find out the positional value and then multiply by the positional digit. Write the positional value. Multiply it by the positional digit. Positional digit is one. One into thirty-two. Positional digit is one. One into two. Then add the values. It will give the give you the answer. That's how you convert to decimal. Even if it is an octal number, you have to apply the same method. Okay. So since we have learned a lot actually, and time is also up, I'm going to actually finish the session from this level. So do you have any question to ask from me? Or oh, can you try with two thousand nineteen and eighteen papers now? Can you try to so even without this knowledge you can answer the paper? 
but can you try to answer all the questions in 2017 18 and 19 papers okay next week i will check so you have homework you have to complete 17 yeah. 18 19 papers 17 to 19 all papers not completely only this number system only this number system things so please try to find out answers for this okay with that i'll stop from this and next day we can continue okay okay then i'll up, i'll upload this to yes i'll upload this note to classroom as well as, well as i'll share in whatsapp don't worry i'll upload the note and i'll share in whatsapp then you can write down okay tomorrow definitely i'll share but i'll try my level best to share it today itself okay then thank you very much see you next week Bye. thank you sir thank you thank you sir, thank you, sir. Yeah, come, bye.